have you had a, an, an important mentor in this whole thing? And if so, or more than one, um, who who is it or who are they? And then um, what what do you think you can check it out from having a, a mentor, I guess, mentory relationship? Yeah. So I mean, I man, that's a tough one because I I, I would say as far as like photography and videography there's two guys that kind of helped me out but this is a little bit later in my journey and this is kind of when i started getting a little better yeah. in understanding like lighting and reflection with lighting and stuff like that and for sure dale dale mr ask productions he is a commercial pilot he's in australia and we became friends um on instagram how i think it was because he was wearing uh Seiko SPV 143 and somehow mm -hmm. I was in the middle of trying to buy one and I think I reached out to him and we somehow kind of became friends and now we're good friends and uh, he's given me a lot of tips a lot of pointers on like you know the camera settings and the lighting and then another guy is Brandon he now works for Houdinki but I met him uh, before he was working for Houdinki his name is Brandon Venancio and he's given me tips also about the videography part of things and I take notes, mental notes of how he kind of does his video production where it's more fun, it's more yeah. like a week on the wrist. If you go to Houdini, yeah. you check out his week on the wrist. It's so effortlessly. And I always tell him like, how do you do it? And it's like, I don't know, man, I just, yeah. That, that's how he talks, like, that's yeah. how he is. Shout I'm like, I, I just Shout out to Brandon, you know, I, Mr. I respect it. Production. And the watch, Dave, just the watch. I mean, he, that guy's yeah. a huge influence. And Dave is actually the reason I met P. Ross to begin with. He had about a thousand something subscribers on his channel. I had about a uh, Dave, and I had about 80 or 50, and P. Ross had about 30 subscribers. And he made a video of like underrated watch channels. And P. Ross was on that list, and I was on that list. And it was, it came out of nowhere. Thanks to that, that day I remember I got like over 100 subscribers and it was huge, it was massive. And I met P. Ross That's and right. just kind of became friends from there. And I remember being there when uh, Dave hit 100,000 subscribers mm. and did a live stream. And I was Shout out to Dave for just a while. It was a good feeling. I was super proud of him. And he is uh, a Christian man and he is in Japan.